Hello everyone and welcome back. Bro Silly here and for week three of Shipyard Champions we have our revenge video. The Seiya got sunk all of our ships and so this week we will be taking it on again. This time with a budget of five billion dollars to design any ship of any nation of any year and to try and sink every single ship. For this time, the Sega is not alone. She will have a escorting fleet. Little side note, also, I'm using the balance mod. I uh, totally forgot the balance mod uninstalls itself every time the game updates, so I don't think I had the balance mod on last time. But this time I do. And here's basically how the point system works. I get one point for every enemy ship I sink, one point for every five torpedo hits on an enemy ship, Two points for sinking every single enemy ship. I lose a point uh, for every ship that I lose, and I lose another point for every five torpedo hits I take. And the win condition, I I have to sink the Seager. I do not get any points if I do not sink the Seager. And I also do not get any points if I lose all of my ships. And I only get one attempt. Fantastic. So there will be the Seager, one German battleship, Two heavy cruisers and two destroyers will be the enemy task force. And what I'm thinking is I do three American 1940 battleships. What could possibly go wrong? Oklahoma, almost 100,000 tons, 32 knots, maximum bulkheads, almost maximum training. Pretty much everything here is maxed out. We got torpedoes and everything. So we'll have six per side. So that's more than enough to get those points. I'm trying to make those torpedoes give me a lot of points. Let's do this. Alright. Well, from the looks of it, they the ships I designed loaded it correctly. Let's test this out. Hopefully. Hopefully the Sega doesn't have the range to fire at us. Why are you sailing away from us? I thought we could fire at them, but I guess not. Let's turn directly that way, times 10. They spotted us. We have the ability to fire. Three and a half percent, it's not bad. We're ricocheting. Let's fire. Do I have HE range from here? I do have HE range. We're gonna fire some HE from here. Just get that accuracy up. Yeah, get that damage in. Closing the distance a little bit too much for my liking. And then again, our accuracy isn't really going up yet. Let's turn away a little bit. Oh, I missed that. accuracy looking like. I got a penetration with HE? Dang. Maybe this was the play. Are we closing? We are closing. I'm gonna turn away again. Just a little bit. I feel like as soon as they start firing at us we're gonna have problems. They're still closing and I don't like that necessarily. Right to a point where we should start not closing. So they still haven't fired at us. We're almost at 30 kilometers. I feel like I should probably turn away now. So we're trying to take out their superstructure. 
see what's happening over here. Oh, they're firing at us. Oh no, they're hitting us. Run away. This thing's getting a little too close. South Carolina, focus on whatever this is. Actually, all secondary guns focus on whatever that is. Oh, they don't have range, okay. Everybody get out of there. Retreat. Retreat. What are we firing at? Still the battleship, yeah. It is its superstructure took a little bit of damage. That's good. I was hoping I can wipe it out entirely. We seem to be running out of HE. Alright, let's I'll go back to auto. South Carolina. Take out that dang heavy cruiser, will you? Hitting anything with our inch guns. And she can switch to HE. Torpedo launchers are turned. Yes. As soon as that thing gets within 2.2 km range, we're gonna fire torpedoes. Wait, no, it is within that range. It was, I guess, bad angle. And the sea goes pretty much out of range. Once this thing dies, we're going back to 10 times speed. We need pens now. Very small pens, but we are getting pens. Partial penning the uh, I forgot how to pronounce this the ocean harbor. Whatever the ocean harbor. Oh my back turret went down. I didn't even realize. Or in that case, I guess fire your main guns at this thing since you can't use it for anything else. Again, see if I get guns on target. I'm gonna take this thing out. This thing has torpedoes, right? Just mostly underwater torpedoes, but I did give it 11 inch guns. Oh, I didn't make this for vanilla, so. Let's see, they're reloading in 11 seconds. I got against our 16 inch armor with like. Really good city of the alarm. Yeah, we're gonna, they're gonna have a chain block. We're pretty much taking those out now. Let's close a little bit to this heavy cruiser. Maybe we can even fire torpedoes at them if we're lucky. We destroyed their torpedoes. Yeah, actually, let's let's close in. Let's torpedo this heavy cruiser because I didn't specify when the torpedoes had to be hit. I mean, they didn't have to hit the Sega, they just hit anything. Maybe we'll cripple this thing and then go uh, fish out some torpedoes against it. losses are getting really steep for 
Actually, both ships. Micro losses. Yeah, a little bit on the South Carolina. Towers are too fancy anymore. I take out, yeah, I took out their main tower. Their accuracy's gone. How far away am I from this guy? Only 40 kilometers? Yeah, let's definitely start turning back in a little bit. Sager's taking penetrations, but very small penetrations. I flooded them a whole bunch of times, but they've taken zero flooding from really all of it. They were trying to steam toward me. It looks like the two destroyers are screening the Sega, which means that they won't be any help. I don't know who the other heavy cruiser is. It does say there's two. I don't know where the second one is. So... Is it detached? Maybe it's also screening for the battleship? Oh, we're getting really good hits against the... Whatever the heck you pronounce this like. They're out of torpedoes. We haven't even fired our torpedoes yet. Oh, save, save. I think it's going to change very much. I want to make sure I have enough shells to deal with the Sager. This thing without torpedoes is actually... might just be a sponge for torpedoes at this point. So I think I'm going to go... I'm going to turn... I kind of want to turn in more. Turn more see if we can't torpedo this thing. Put on save. I want a really good chance to hit before I torpedo it. It's 20 kilometers out. Is this thing turning? Turning away. This thing's gonna sink soon. I'm actually gonna. I'm doing really good against the Sega. So maybe I'll just shoot this thing down. Yeah, just wait for the battleship to be crippled before we do anything crazy. I'm going to have the South Carolina detach and follow this. So she can go as fast as she wants, and these guys can go as fast as they want. Let's switch this to auto. Auto. So you guys can fire AP at the heavy cruiser now if you want. I'm seeing a lot of blocks and partial pens. That is so super fun. So you guys taking hits. We're firing at HE at Ken for some reason. Follow up fire AP please. Did we get close enough to a point where we can't pen them anymore? If that's the case I can go away. I think they're, the ship over here is gonna. Uh, it might flood out. Yeah, it's gonna flood out.
Maybe not. No, actually, they might not float out. Sager is starting to take some hits again. It's taking a tiny bit of flooding. It is down to 19 knots. So that's a penetration, but it didn't really do anything. South Carolina, I kind of want South Carolina to go take care of that thing. Yeah, South Carolina, you gotta torpedo the shit out of that. And these guys continue their little escapade against the San Diego. Why is my mouse shaking? What? Why is my mouse shaking? What? What the heck? Okay. South Carolina's gonna turn in. Firing AP against the Steger. I'm not gonna turn you HE. And I want you to just sink this thing. You need to hit it with torpedoes a couple times. And what angle is it coming at? That's a good angle. I should go straight toward it, and as I drive by, the torpedo should hit it. These guys are going to continue to engage. I'm losing accuracy. I'm too far. Turn a little bit down. Are we doing too good against this thing? That's yeah, okay. So we're getting fired at now. Uh oh. Let's actually turn the guns off. Oh no, I've taken a hit. Let's see if I can't get some hits on this thing. Not a great angle. Let's see if I can't speed past it. I'm gonna turn in. Try doing a little bit of a drive by. You're getting a little too close for comfort. Did I just... Who did I fire to get us against? This? Better than that. Did I fire to get us against that piece? So I have electric torpedo? No, oxygen. So I would like all of my torpedoes to fire, please. And then I'm going to do another little turn around and run away now. Oh, fire against this thing, please. And the torpedo hits. I thought I had a couple more launchers, but maybe they got destroyed. Uh, I think a couple might have got destroyed. They're getting out of there. Okay, let's just go auto, auto, save, save. Let's get out of here now. These guys are way off course. Let's get in there. Shoot this thing, please. South Carolina's not looking too hot. I don't think I had a single torpedo here, did I? No. I missed every single torpedo. Awesome. Love torpedoes, they're so fun. Though I think the ships, yeah, that ship's gonna sink anyway. Have that run away for a bit. These guys are turning in a little bit too fast. 
It's okay. It's also a night battle now. Probably should have made a morning. Oh well. So that is one point for us. To not get those torpedoes off from the South Carolina. They still got more they still got more torpedoes, so I can have them come back if we cripple this egg or not. Oh. Okay, well if this is the range we need to stay at, then I will stay at this range. 35 kilometers? Yeah, we're getting real good penetrations now. We've worn down their armor. Firing HE. About to run out of HE. Ooh. That was a very disappointing salvo. Destroyed main tower. Perfect. I like that. And then I think we got too close. We're out of the oh we're out of HE. Yeah, HE was doing all the penetrations, funnily enough. Also, since we destroyed the main tower, they no longer have range, which means. Let's have the South Carolina come back and take out the Victoria Louise. Louise? Louise? Something like that. Really good hits against the Sega. We're only doing 19.2 knots now. We are closing the distance a little bit. Not anymore. The tower keeps getting destroyed. We're firing at the heavy cruiser now. Which at 19, kilom 19 kilometers. There's a 14 kilometer range for torpedoes. So about, I think that's right, yeah, there it is. Start turning away. I'm getting hit. I don't think the SIG is firing any, is it? No, it doesn't even see anybody. Let's turn away big time. Are we getting penned by a heavy cruiser? There's no way. 8 inch guns, do your job. Ricochet? What? You should have out of HE ammo. Can't be out of HE ammo. I built these ships too well. Oh, you're f that's it. Main guns. Take them out. Take them out. I'm gonna angle. Turn quicker. I'm getting flooded by a heavy cruiser. Got them all. There you go. He's dead now. Yeah, that's. Well, I thought it was decent. Yep. I'm sure he enjoyed being alive. We will uh, no longer be alive though. Can I fire torpedoes please? Oh yeah, he's going down. Where are my, my ship's over here. Are we still going away? Are we too far? Uh, let's go this way. Let's 
thousand fire torpedoes. We are in torpedo range. Both of our torpedo launchers are just not firing. She flood out. What the heck? They spotted torpedoes yet. Are they trying to turn? Oh, I think they've lost all their speed while they're shooting at them. Oh, they're missing. Okay. Dang it, that was such a good torpedo thing, too. A torpedo solution. I thought I was still, I'm still gonna hit one. Uh, as much as I would love that to count, I'm going to say it doesn't. And I would have done it anyways. South Carolina, I'm going to follow you back. You can go normal, normal, and just fall back for now. We are running out of ammo, actually. Hold on, I'm gonna have to bring South Carolina back. We're taking hits. 24 kilometers. They have no accuracy, though. They have 8 inch secondaries, I also have 8 inch secondaries. However, I'm running out of ammo on my guns. South Carolina, hold on, you might have to come back. Hold on, South Carolina, come back here. Full speed, please. That sends the center right there. Sega is definitely flooding. Plenty of ammo though. Tita's let's, let's get pretty close. I don't like that I'm running out of ammo. It's not Oh, it's not fun. Every time times times ten speed. I like that. Try to get as close as possible. Fire all the guns. I definitely don't think they're flooding out. So I might have to go for those torpedo hits. I mean, I have to sink it. It's so slow that even my South Carolina could probably catch up. Running out of ammo, let's get pretty close, trying to get our accuracy up. Running out of ammo. I'm gonna go straight from here on. About 25 clicks. Some decent last hits before we're out of ammo. Come on. We're almost all out of ammo. This is Oklahoma's last salvo. That's Oklahoma's last salvo. And Georgia will have one shell left to fire. I wonder, if I have one shell left to fire, does they fire, do they fire full 
Yeah, they fire all three. Okay. So that is good damage in the Sega. Now their guns are returning fire, that's the problem. Oh, our 8 inches are returning fire now, actually. Sager is flooding. This is South Carolina. So unless I want to unload torpedoes into this thing, I gotta make sure it dies 100%. And then I'm out of 16 inch gun ammo. Oh boy. That's not fun. Compared to those 18 inch guns. But they are light shelled 18 inch guns. With AP, they are at a very close range. They're not that close. Oh boy, that's one penetration. I did take it like a champ. Thinking about closing the gap. Getting those torpedoes into range and firing them. Not firing anymore? Hello. Uh, we have range or something? At the very least, I'd like to find the destroyers and sink them, and then sink the Sega, so at least they get all points. It is very flooded, going very slow. Let's see if I can't sneak around it. Because I can still do pretty much all of my speed. 1 times 10, perfect. And then battleship's going over there. Let's send Sega. Or not out of the South Carolina towards Sega. On like an intercept, intercept, interception course. The destroyers are on that side of it. So I can find those and I can take those out. I already took out the heavy cruisers. I range with the 8 inch guns again. So why are they firing? What? There we go. Keep destroying the main tower. Our secondary tower is almost gone. The destroyers are still on that side. Gosh damn this. In South Carolina. Oh, perfect. Oh, uh, save. Let's put these save, save, and save. When it kind of in. Yeah, actually, this is fine because of the sec that. The X turret is out of commission, so points straight on anyways. And this is the point where I try and get in there and fire torpedoes. Let's get a little bit more in there, because since the destroyers are right behind them, I'll hit something. And then open up with torpedoes when I. 22.2 kilometer range. This is less than 19 kilometers. Fire torpedoes whenever. Early now. Yep, that's what I was trying to avoid. The torpedoes are aimed. Why aren't you firing?
taking damage over here now. Torpedoes, fire police. Torpedoes, why am I not firing my torpedoes? Okay, aggressive. What? Target this thing. Why aren't you firing torpedoes? Fire torpedoes. Okay, Georgia. Oh, why is no one firing torpedoes? What? What is this nonsense? We're at like not even that big of a range. Sager's gonna sink before I even get a chance to fire from torpedoes. Do I just pull a full about face? Put these on save and go that way, I guess. South Carolina's coming in. It's a little bit too close, don't you think, South Carolina? Let's go that way. Some normal as well. I actually might sink this egg in before I get my torpedoes ready. Real quick, accelerate. You guys are going so slow. Oops. Okay, Georgia, detach. Full speed ahead. You, Oklahoma, turn away a bit since you're pretty much useless now to me. I'm sure I can sink the Sega before it's even... Oh gosh dang it. No, don't sink it! Fire HE! What? Fire... Fire... Fire secondaries against this thing, please. There you go. Eight inches, open up. Eight inches? Hello? How do I get a flooding hit? What? I gotta turn away for fear torpedoes now. What? Then why am I not turning? Uh. Well, this is awkward. Okay. Am I not gonna turn? I guess. Oh, that poor man. Did we not hit any torpedoes? No torpedoes again. Dang it! And the South Carolina strip just not turning. Oh, you're out of torpedoes. Okay, well, I guess it's uh. Are you guys out of ammo? What's happening? Fire, fire, please. Just fire torpedoes at what? What I just fired torpedoes at? Oh, I took a one torpedo hit, but it's for every five torpedo hits. I don't think... I'm firing torpedoes from this boat, but I don't think any of them are going to find a target by the time it sinks, which is, looks like it's going to be in seconds. Come on, South Carolina, if you've stopped firing for a second and did not kill the poor destroyer. You're going to kill the poor destroyer, aren't you? Lovely. It's gonna sink. 
Well, I mean, I succeeded in what I wanted to do, which was sink the entire enemy force. I did not get any torpedo hits though, which is disappointing because I had the perfect, perfect shot against the Sager with my torpedoes and my ships refused to fire. Oh, that's just not fun. So no points lost and I got, let's do the math right now. So one point for every enemy ship that I sank. That is five points in total. One point for every five torpedo hits. Probably should have made that one torpedo hit because that was really hard to get torpedo hits, but zero for that. Two additional points for sinking all of the enemy ships. I got an additional two, so that's seven. One point taken away for every ship that I lose. Uh, kept all three of my ships alive. And one point taken away for every five torpedoes, for every five torpedo hits that are scored on my own ships. But I only took one torpedo, so. A grand total of seven points, which I suspect will be the average of everyone else's scores. I assume everyone else will even have a lot more torpedo hits than me. But that is my score, seven points. Not a bad score. That fight did take forever, but oh well. What are you going to do about it? All right. Well, thanks everyone so much for watching, and if you enjoy this type of content, I will putting up the Shipyard Champions playlist where I will have all of the contestants videos including my own and if you like me and my content in particular I will be putting up my most recent Dreadnoughts campaign right about now and honestly if you like my voice subscribe like comment do all of the above or just one anything works really in the end thanks so much for watching I will see you guys later bye bye